Hey, good afternoon, everybody. I am out here in north or southwest Farmington, Utah, or maybe it's northwest Centerville, Utah. I'm not exactly sure where this address precisely falls. But either way, we are out here today to witness, hopefully, a transit of the International Space Station across the face of the sun, as found on transitfinder.com. We come out here, it is about to happen in about 10 minutes, and I'm going to put the solar filter here on the camera and zoom in, and we're, as I say, about 10 minutes away, and we'll see what we get. And I'll be back in a few minutes and start recording again, but I've also brought with me my shortwave radio, and I've got it tuned to 15 megahertz, which is currently playing the time from the National Institute of Standards and Technology in Honolulu in this case. And so this will be a good way to get a time stamp of the transit. At the tone, 18 hours, 10 minutes, coordinated universal time. Now that's 18 hours and 10 minutes UTC and that's six hours ahead of my time. So the time here is currently 12.10. And this pass is supposed to happen at 12.19 and eight seconds. So we'll see just how accurate that is. It'll be a good way to test the accuracy of both transitfinder.com and the accuracy of its path if this happens. I should be just a little south of center center line for the pass and according to transit finder the station is supposed to take up almost one full arc minute across the sun so it should be readily visible because the camera can easily resolve that so i will get set up and we will be back in a minute thank you all right i am recording we are about one minute out as you can see we've got some nice sunspots on there that should hopefully make the station more visible and I can't get this tripod to settle at any more centered location but that should still be good enough. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, well, hopefully we got it. We're now two minutes past the predicted time, so we'll see what we get when we get home. I didn't see it pass on the viewfinder, but I'm wearing sunglasses, and the pass was predicted to only take three quarters of a second, so I could have easily missed it. And the station itself would be roughly the size of that large sunspot, so it would have only been on a handful of frames. Anyway, we'll get back and we'll see what we got. All right, here's just a little post-transit follow-up. I watched back on the view screen and replay and verified that I could indeed see it. Uh, here are the coordinates that I was at at the moment. I'm just standing outside my car here, and give me one second. And here was my location on Google Maps, just west of I-15, southwest of Farmington, northwest of Centerville. And I will go home and I will find the image of the transit path and I will post that along in the video too so you can compare my location there, that blue arrow, with where the pass was supposed to occur.